We just want to thank Perfect Potions, giving us some beard oil, and then we got uh, some body oil, some beard balm. One day, Shout out. Maybe. One day maybe when I get older, when I hit, when I hit puberty. There we go. <laughs> we got the champ back in town. We're gonna introduce him, KB. What's up with it, man? in the title, Markel, to the left. What's going on? Anybody got any IG names? Groovy Kel. Groovy Kel. Team Brandon is gonna put in some work. We coming yeah. for that title, baby. Come on with it. Come on with it. Come on with it. the water whatever you need How long enough for your time? I know, I got some bunion.
Right. I got to take that back. Yes, in it.
unless you don't want the money. So now you're getting money every game. See what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah that's really good. Look. How you pull that up? How'd you pull it off, man? It's a good game, man. Set? Just sticking in there, having that Kobe mentality. Just keep pushing, keep going. He's yeah, a great good, player, man. though, honestly. Yeah, I was uh, played a great game. I was wondering how you were gonna adjust because he was he was guarding your drive really well, and right. then your shot wasn't hitting. And it was good to see you not let it get too mental, and you just stuck with it. Definitely. You know, there was even a time where he got so comfortable, he was talking to the camera, talking to the ref, like, I got this game in a bag. Right. And the next thing you know, upside down, yeah. it's 1-1, one, one, and now you skunked in the last round. So, that's, that's a great ball. game. Yeah. Appreciate you having me. Oh, yeah. So, with the three ball. It was hitting, man. So, introducing now the champ, the new champ in the 5'8 to 6' foot category. Yeah, yeah, break. now has a title in every champ, baby, every category. We taking over, baby. Yeah. <laughs> KB, man. What's up with you? Feedback on the game. Oh, man, they're uh, a good competitor, man. Uh, you know, down stretch, I got kind of uh, comfortable. Thought I had it in the bag. Got a little tired. Shot went broke, you know. Taking up from him. He got a good shock on him. Uh, you know, I'll be back. Ain't nothing. Yeah, three. Three huh? ball. Yeah, the yeah, three, the three ball. ball fell off. And, That's what you know, I was telling him. I was like, you, you, were, you were covering ground. You took away his drive. Yeah. And then uh, he wasn't comfortable shooting. We could see that right off the bat. So I was like, man, this is going to be a tough game for Markel. And then you started yeah. kind of chuckling it up a little bit with the camera and the ref. And I'm like, oh, he's got this game in a bag. And then all I did was I take it. So and that's the thing about these first one games. If any player hits two threes in a row, they get in a rhythm. Yeah. It changes yeah. the game. Yeah, he got into a little rhythm. Shit, there at the second game, got to a rhythm. I couldn't get him out of it, man. Just giving him open shots. Uh, fatigue played a big factor in that, too, man. But yeah. I'll be back. All right. Hey, man. Thanks for holding it down for so long. Proud. It's good to see you, All right. Be swishing the house. Congrats to Markel, the new champ. He's been on the ropes many, many times. This is an interesting situation. You got a player that keeps almost getting beaten by a lot of different people and somehow he comes back at the end what do y'all think man is it the mentality what's going on i know he's got a, a, a three-point shot but the fact that he's able to hit that three-point shot under pressure that's pretty clutch so you know that's the characteristic of a champ he is officially the champ it is what it is i'd like to hear your comments um Bama, do y'all remember Bama? Bama played Markel and actually did pretty well against Markel. Bama took another L. Bama took like he took an L to G. Cole. He took an L to Markel. Maybe somebody else. I don't really I don't really remember for sure. But on verse one, you take a couple of L's, man. You're out, you're kind of out of the picture. So right now. Jump over to V1F Uncut. I'm going to give him another shot. I'm coming back. Name a W. No more L. No more L's. No. Ain't, nobody, ain't nobody getting past the second one. Oh. 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 Jump over to V1F Uncut. The link is under here. <laughs> the link is at the bottom. And also... Uh, all the license holders have access to this channel, so you're going to see possibly uploads. I think G. Cole's been uploading a few just little random things on that channel. Also, uh, the mayor is a license holder in Italy. He did a big tournament. It's called the Big Booties Tournament out there in Italy. It's kind of a pretty big deal. And uh, so I posted that game. Uh, check that out. V1F Uncut. Subscribe to the channel. We just started it. But um, the main the main thing that differentiates V1F Uncut from Verse One Federation channel here, V1F Uncut is going to be license holders can upload commentary, vlog style, you know, whatever they want, and recruit new players. So you'll see me bringing on new people, and then they'll elevate like Ninja Warrior style to the next round if they win. So I'm gonna do my best to kick people's asses. Bama said he ain't taking no losses, man. He said it's gonna be a dub. You ask him what he wanna do. All three is away. What's up, man? 
What, 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 you, what you want? You threes or layers? What you want to say, man? I don't know. He might get caught slipping being cocky.